hosting an event today at lovely Eight Club uh, in Moorgate, focusing on incoming legislation around GDPR, which is live from uh, May 2018. GDPR affects everyone, from a one-man band to Tesco's, the biggest business in the world. Today really as they talk right through from how do we manage using technology, some of the issues pertaining to GDPR, and from our side as a consultancy, how do we integrate those technologies, and then how do we help our clients actually manage the, the people element and train. It isn't a one-time fix. It really is an ongoing process to ensure that each business is compliant with GDPR and it isn't something you stick your head in the sand and ignore. We have to address it and we must be prepared and that's what today is about. We are consultatively led, so it is about understanding your business, how you work uh, and I guess how GDPR affects you. We're going to showcase some very good technologies that can help you manage data end-to-end, -end, in and out of your environment, looking at deletion policies and management, vehicles for actually notifying clients, businesses around data breaches, which is a big part of GDPR. Imagine it as current data protection legislation with a bit more teeth. So my name is Joe Carson, I'm an independent consultant, I work for many companies. So as we go through this, I want to make sure that you get the important pieces, important information that really helps you prepare and really leave today so that you can actually already start making actions to be able to actually implement and uh, get prepared for the general data protection regulation. Many companies really don't know that this regulation is coming and they don't know if the regulation applies to them. And that's one of the critical importance of this event, to really bring awareness, transparency, that those companies, it does apply to them. They will need to do something immediately. You only collect the pieces of data that you need to perform the action that you intend to use it for. And this also means that it's relevant for the purposes actually collected for. So if you're collecting it for um, logistics and delivery, then it cannot be used for any other means. So hopefully today we'll get some information shared, some knowledge and experience, and really allow companies here in the UK to really get prepared and ready so that they can comply when the regulatory actually compliance comes in, in place in May. GDPR, you know, is an interesting piece of legislation, obviously coming out in 2018. A lot of organizations are, are in the process now of trying to prepare for that. What we're seeing is a lot of uh, challenges in organizations today where they have a very multi-vendor, best-of-breed approach, a uh, very siloed approach to, you know, their risk analysis. And as a result of that, they're losing a lot of context in terms of the, the wider threat that, that they may be under. So having these different elements of enforcement points throughout your environment, whether that be the network, whether that be the endpoint, whether that be the cloud, actually communicating with one another and ensuring that we aren't you know, missing the forest through the trees, for example, and maintaining not just uh, you know, a state-of-the-art environment with regards to technology, but also providing a state-of-the-art environment for also the people and the processes that are so important for uh, the overall security of an organization. How do we automate a lot of the activity over here to make this human pain go away so that we can focus the man hours and the human brain power on actual action as opposed to tactical response and constantly putting out fires. GDPR is a, a huge regulation that's going to affect every business in Europe and globally, and uh, Veronis is best placed to be able to help them get control and meet those articles that are in the new draft. It's really great coming here to this Chrome event because they're really drawing attention to GDPR. Many organisations are not prepared for GDPR. But it was very, very useful um, to find out more about it. You know, obviously it's going to be highly relevant and highly necessary to um, have that, that kind of knowledge. So it was a good start. It was a good initiation. It's given us a, a good insight into all the areas that we need to look into, the amount of work that we need to do, and um, also to start to get prepared now rather than wait until uh, May 2018. We've got quite a lot to do. Uh, we've got a lot of, a lot of good information, uh, a lot of information I'm going to feed back to the team, a lot of uh, understanding on different technologies, how we're going to use those technologies moving forward and it obviously helps us understand what, what can be done and what, and what we can use.